Good morning. <laughs> I still got to unpack most of my clothes. Good morning, guys. So as you guys have already read in the title, we're going to be reviewing the fidget toy set box that I got from Amazon. And let's see which ones are the best fidgets. All right, guys. So I got the box right here. I got this on the side just because I know this is a really popular fidget toy. Uh, we're going to review it as well. It didn't come with this box set or this fidget toy set, but I wanted to review this as well. It's pretty popular. Well, let's see what's inside of this fidget toy set. All right, so here it is. Um, it comes with a lot of toys. Uh, I think the price was only like $15. I'll put it up in the screen uh, so you show you guys what the price was. But it comes with a lot of toys, and it didn't, I don't know, it looks pretty cool. Uh, you're a gift to those around you. Oh, thank you. It also comes with these little uh, inspirational cards. I think they're like birthday cards, it looks like. So you can give these away to people as well. All right, moment of truth. Let's get these out of the box right now. All right, so it looks like uh, we got a little basketball. It's like a stress ball one. We got some noodles, some worms. I don't know what these are actually. It's pretty cool. We got some another, more balls. Pretty, pretty cool. Uh, I have no idea what this does, but I will look it up. Uh, this little hourglass thing with liquid in it. I don't know. We'll, I'll, we'll try that later. Uh, these little rings. Don't know what they do, but we'll open them in a little bit. We got these little pouches with the marble inside of them. Pretty cool, we'll try that in a little bit. We have a Rubik's Cube. I don't know why this is, well I guess it's a fidget because Rubik's Cubes are meant to be, for are meant for anxiety and like people that, you know, work with their hands a lot. Um, we have more of these little pouches and I think, oh we have a little pea pouch, I don't know. We'll try it out in a little bit. All right, before I do that, I need to go pick up a package from my mom's house. Come with me, let's go. Also need to wash the car, but maybe that's a good thing because this is a satisfying video, like fidgets, you know, and uh, washing the car can be satisfying. I don't know, maybe, we'll see. All right, let's go. All right, I have the package. Let's go. Okay, now we're back. Let's go ahead and review these fidget toys. First item, we have a stress ball. It's a basketball stress ball. Squishes pretty good, pretty stress relieving, not bad. All right, pretty good. Next is everyone's favorite, the popper. This one that I have is shaped like a heart and it's got ABCs on the poppers and it's got a little heart at the bottom. It's pretty satisfying to push these down and hear the little ploop sound. Here, listen, ready? It honestly gets like a 10 out of 10. I've been playing with this all day. So very satisfying and very good. I love it. Oh yeah, guys, if you guys want one of these fidget toy boxes, I'm not sponsored by them, but if you want one, uh, I'll put the link below. I'll also give away all of these. So comment down below which one you want and I'll pick some random people to get these toys because I don't want all of these, but some of you guys might. So comment down below right now. And of course, make sure you guys like and subscribe. Okay, let's keep going. Next up, we have the Rubik's Cube. Obviously, you guys know what a Rubik's Cube is. You guys have probably seen it so many times and it's actually pretty fun. Um, I'd never ever learn how to solve it. So uh, if anybody wants to teach me, let me know. But I've never ever solved one of these by myself. So maybe I'll look it up and see how they do it. I can always just solve just one side, but I can't do all six. So it's just fun to play around with and maybe I'll learn one day. I'll learn how to solve a Rubik's Cube. Also, I'm sorry for the audio if it sounds very echoey. I just moved to this place. There's almost there's nothing in here so that there's mad echo. So I apologize for the echo in advance. OK, let's keep going. Next, we have these little squishy net balls. These. Oh, yeah, I can play with this all day. These are actually so freaking cool. Oh, they feel so cool. Now, this is way better than a stress ball. Oh, that looks so cool. <laughs> I'm probably gonna end up popping it, but hopefully I don't. But these are so cool. This bag also comes with these little spiky ones. These are pretty cool to play with. Oh, but these are my favorite. I could probably play with this all day. This one gets a 10 out of 10. These are the two that got 10 out of 10, so I'll put them together. This one's just, eh, it's all right. It's not a 10 out of 10, but it's still fun to like hold. Next up, we have these little worms. They're like noodles, they're not worms. They feel pretty cool. Uh, they're very stretchy. Here, I'm gonna use both hands, hold on. Uh, as you can see, they're pretty stretchy. They're pretty fun to like fling around. 
I don't know, they're pretty cool. My cat likes these. <laughs> Uh, I don't know, it came with a bunch of different colors. The box did, it comes with all of these, so it's pretty cool, it's like a rainbow. Uh, I'll rate this probably like a six out of 10. They're pretty fun, but I get bored with, I'll get bored really quick with these. Next, we have this little fidget. I just broke it. <laughs> it's not completely broken, it just separates, so you can attach it back, which is pretty cool. So you can make different shapes and you know make it really long or really short, or make it into a circle, make it into a square. Every one of these little uh, joints bends, so you can play with it, you know, make little, little, little structures. Pretty cool, just like that. I don't know. Looks cool. It looks like a little dragon. I don't know if you guys can see that. It looks pretty cool. And yeah, it's pretty fun. Uh, not as fun as the other one, so I'll rate this one a five out of 10. Next, we have this little hourglass lava lamp looking thing. It's pretty satisfying just to watch. It's not really a fidget because you just, you know, you don't really, you just gotta watch it, I guess. It's fun to watch, but it's not a really a fidget because you can't touch it. You just gotta let it sit in your desk just like that. It's pretty cool, it's bubbling up down here. I don't know if you guys can see that. Uh, it's cool. Pretty satisfying. What's wrong, sad girl? It's okay. So there we have it. I think I'm gonna rate this one maybe another six out of 10. It's cool just to look at, but not to touch, I guess. Pretty cool. Next, we have these little pouches. They have a little marble inside. I don't know if you guys can see that. There it is. And it's pretty fun to play with, actually. This is definitely a fidget that I could see myself playing with a lot, so. I'm gonna, for that factor, I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10. Not as satisfying as the other ones that are tens, but just as good. Next, we have these little rings. They're like inner, lob, inner looping rings. Um, they just spin around on, into each other. Uh, it's pretty satisfying. I don't know if you guys can really see it. You, got, you, you technically need two hands for this, but they just spin around and it's pretty fun to like just spin them around in your finger. Pretty fun fidget actually, so. I could see myself playing with this in my pocket or like, you know, around just over and over like a fidget spinner. So I'm going to give this a eight out of 10 because it's kind of hard actually. And my hands hurt now. <laughs> I've been playing with it for like two minutes and my hands started, my fingers are starting to hurt now. So eight out of 10, but it's still pretty fun. All right. Last but not least, we have the pea pod. Now this one's pretty cool. It's just a little pea pod. And if you push on the little pouches, the peas come out. As you can see right there, peas come out. Pretty satisfying. It's a pretty good keychain, a uh, little toy you can put in your keychain uh, and just play with it. It's pretty fun actually, and it's kind of cute. So I'm gonna give this one a 10 out of 10. Yeah. Oh my God, I didn't see that it has faces. They have little faces, that's so cute. I didn't know that. That one doesn't. But the middle one does. Peek-a-boo, peek -a That's so cute. The other ones don't, but the middle one does. That's cute. All right, I'm gonna give this a 10 out of 10, of course. And that is all of them. That's the last of the box. Pretty good, actually. It's a pretty good bang for your buck. Um, it comes with a lot of toys and uh, it wasn't too expensive, so pretty good, honestly. And obviously my personal favorite was these. These are actually super satisfying. If you could feel these, you would know what I'm talking about. But let me know if you guys want some. I'll give these away actually, because I have like three over there. All right, that is all folks. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and the like button if you haven't already done so. The fidget ball is watching. Posting another video for you guys very soon. So make sure you guys have the bell on as well. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace, bye.